Here's a question that I'm sure you've been asked more than once, maybe even more than twice. <laughs> what is your favorite weapon? My favorite weapon? Intelligence. I'm not just being clever, although I am. Um, it, it, understand what intelligence means. It means smarts, you know, your ability to process information, yada, 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 yada. And be able to apply old information to new situations. That's intelligence. But I also mean intelligence, information, like intelligence gathering. All, right? all the stuff we talked about knowing about your opponent, to be able to push his buttons, to become the locus of control of your opponent's behavior, that's intelligence. It allows you to do that. So my favorite weapon, yes, intelligence in, in both regards. I don't think that's what people usually mean when yes, they I ask know. you. I know. They want to know, mm, do you like the rapier, the small sword? What's your, you know, that's that's what people are asking. Um, I don't usually address that because it's an idiot fucking question. This is like asking a carpenter, oh, what's your favorite tool? Are you a hammer guy? Are you a saw man? Or are you a screwdriver guy? See how stupid that is? So the answer is, uh, I'm not emotionally involved. A carpenter uses whatever tool he happens to need to do the job he needs to do. And that's the way I feel about weapons, or, or no weapons. I, I, I don't care. I'll use whatever tool I have to use to do the job I have to do. You know, If it's the right tool for that job, that's my favorite tool at the moment. <laughs> right? If it's the wrong tool for that job, it's not my favorite tool, I'll tell you. you know? So it's kind of like that. So you don't think any of them are better... Then. What's a better tool, a hammer or a saw? Depends on what you need. You know, this like, uh, you know what people love to ask? Here's an idiot question. If this guy had a rapier and if that guy had a long sword, who would win? Yeah. That's, uh, yeah? A, that's a common question. If this question. guy had a sword and that guy, if this guy had a gun, who would win? You know? Um, so that's a stupid question for a, a couple of reasons. Number one is, uh, it's a misconception of the relationship between the fire and the weapon. The weapon does not imbue you with power. You imbue the weapon with power. Right? An asshole with a gun is just an asshole with a gun. The fact that he happens to have a firearm in his possession doesn't suddenly make him a gunfighter. <laughs> you know? You know, wearing scrubs doesn't automatically make you a surgeon, you know. Um, the other part of that is what they're really asking me. What they're really asking me is this. Is there some magical tool? Is there a magic sword? Is there some, uh, is there some gimmick, some trick, some hack that I can do that will allow... Uh, that will allow me, a person with no skill, no knowledge, no experience, and no courage, to overcome someone who does have skill and knowledge and experience and courage. And the answer to that is fucking no. No, there isn't. 